Hey everybody and welcome back to the I Got a Wooden Spoon YouTube channel. We're going to cover worms course today on golf with your friends and look at the best shots that I am aware of. Uh, we'll start today. Everyone pretty much knows about the full shot you can do with that target over there to do it. I kind of don't like it because it messes up every now and then on me. So uh, another shot you can do here is to go 2.7 straight away. And that will get you a hole in one as well. So if you don't want to deal with the targets, you can do that shot. On number two, we want to go just right of the center line, hit the right side of that mine up there. Full power. And that will drop us right in the hole. Number three is a pretty easy one. Uh, so I think the best case scenario is to just go straight about three and a half power. Doesn't need to be exact. Let it go. And then you're just going to flutter this a little bit until it dies with enough speed to go in the hole. Number four. We're going to go right over this corner of this square right here full speed and that will drop us in for a one number five we're gonna look at this corner right here this dark square we're going to go just under three speed. And that will catch the slope for a one. Number six, we're going to aim at the bottom right of this box right in front of us, two and a half speed. And then the rest of it's going to be flying technique. You're going to want to start boosting immediately to go over those rocks. And then kind of just flutter a little bit. Drop it down right here. And then back up. Hole oh, six. This is a glitch shot, but you might want to freeze frame this. It's about one and a half speed right there at that corner. It will die right here in the spot and it will glitch over to that next hole and fall right to the hole. You got to do it quickly or it will not count. Hole 7. Uh, you want to go full speed right here at that little dot on that board there. It will boost you up off that and you will ricochet about 4 feet short of the hole. I've tried a few that went right at the hole could not get to stay in bounds so this is the best play I know of for now. That'll get you easy too. All right, on this hole, we're gonna go down at this hole actually behind us. We're not even gonna play this actual hole. We're gonna play this hole behind us and go just try the pin at just under three power. And that will glitch for a hole in one. Number 10. Number 10, we're going to go down here. Just left this bolt here I'm pointing at. Full power. And that will drop right in for a one. right at these towers here full speed and this will ricochet us over right next to the hole. I've actually had a few go right over the edge of the hole so I'm pretty sure it's possible to go in but hadn't had it happen yet but either way easy tap in for a two. Number 11 
Number 12 here, we're going to go full power down here at the sandbag uh, when the sheep turns around. And as long as you don't get hit by this sheep over here, you should be okay. Uh, from here, you're going to want to go about one and a quarter. Tap it in. Four or two. I can see a shot where you might make that, but it's going to be pure luck. Number 13, we're going to go straight down the center line here at just under three and a half speed. It's going to take a lot of flying, so you're going to have to get your timing down. Drop and get that. And you got a hole in one. That takes a little bit of timing, so you might need some practice. 14. You want to aim at the corner of this dark square here at three and a half power. That will shoot you off in one. So your second shot, you're going to be right about here at this corner of this light square full power that'll blast you off in two for the third shot we're going to go in full power right here at the dark square i'm pointing at on the wall that'll get you in the cannon for a three haven't seen this miss but Assuming it's not possible, but I guess someone could have bad luck. And that'll get you in three. And we're going to aim at whatever that is hanging on the wall back in the background. Full power. Okay. Your second shot, you're going to angle back towards the center a little bit. Full power. Now your third shot, we're going to aim just off the middle of this barrel. One speed. And that'll get it to roll right down to the hole. All right, so 16, we're gonna go at the bottom right of this chest right here. On the left side at 1.1 speed, let it drop off the helmet and you can fly back onto the map. Here, I can see if you get a lucky bounce off the helmet, you might be able to drop it into the hole. I've not done it yet, but if you don't, tap it in for a two. Seventeen, we're gonna go two and a half speed. Right at the right side of this keyhole right here. And we're gonna aim right about this point at two point eight. And the third shot, we're going to do about 2.8 again, a little bit less than last time, uh, just left of the pin. Took a while to find what I wanted to do there, but I think that three is the easiest three. 18, we're going to go slight right, full power. And then we're going to go on the right side of this middle hump, full power again after the bombs drop. Alright, that will shoot us over to the middle.
third shot we're going to go straight away at the pin about 3.7 power when this bomb drops in the front right into the hole for a three thank you guys for watching uh, we're trying to put, do some more uh, courses in the future uh, if you like the channel subscribe and we'll catch you next time